Uh, today in this video in wireless technology we will be discussing regarding the wireless sensor networks the, that is the WSN networks. Now this WSN networks are a small sensor networks in a physical location which is located in order to monitor the temperature conditions and their values like humidity the temperature, the pressure as well as the many other environmental conditions which simulate the wireless environment and it is used in the industry standards so as to monitor the physical conditions and make them cooperate and to install it into a device so that they will communicate with each other in a cooperative manner. So this wireless sensor networks is made by means of a alarm controller which will control the gateway that will receive all of these that is the signals from the senders which are coming from here which is shown in the red color now this uh, now this small circles in between are the sensor networks which will communicate between each other via means of a small jerk or a small powerful signal in between which will last for a very short duration and will ultimately give all the signals back to the gateway which will process it in a cooperative functional manner and it will send to the admin controller which will alarm the signal and it will send it to the database monitor so as to ultimately alarm any of this environmental changes such as the humidity, temperature or any of the pressure changes that happens in the environment. Now this used in the home automation system, the healthcare system, the security systems, the military use as well as the production plants. So in this area WSN networks are most widely used and are more critical in means of any kinds of operations at any time. Next is the protocols of WSN. WSN works by means of three major protocol that is the proactive protocol, reactive protocol and the hybrid protocol. Now this proactive protocol will cooperatively maintain and share a routing info of the current states. It will quickly di divert the controller point in case of any emergency. So this is the most fastest of the three protocol modes. Next is the reactive mode. In reactive mode, it will search for the best possible path and will utilize it. Reactive mode is similar to proactive mode, but in reactive mode, it will search for the best path out of this various other points and will give it to the sensor network so it can utilize it in a better and more efficient manner. Next is the hybrid protocol, which is the mixture of the above two protocols now it has two basic parts that is the local as well as the outer paths. This local path will use the proactive and the outer path will use the reactive in case of dynamic strategies. So this is the a brief introduction regarding the wireless sensor networks. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you found this video helpful, please give a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Thanks for watching this video.